All right, today we're gonna check out a little more extensive look at the Cold Steel Verdict. The new one with the G10 and the OS 10. Alright, so here is, well let's get the old one out first. Here's the old one. This is the F, FRN, Glassfield Nylon GFN. Check that out. So that's the GFN version with the 4116 steel. Really cool knife. Really awesome budget blade. So I'll put that over here. But here is, here's the newer version with the G10. <laughs> this thing is so cool. So this has got the G10, it's got three inch blade, the G10 handles, the OS 10A. Check this out from that view. Have a look at that, very cool. Just a good looking blade, it feels great in the hand. And here's that Tanto version. Of course, Cold Steel's DLC is just amazing. Just super tough on that black coating. So check this out, this is, how it feels in my hand. It just feels like a really nice EDC, like you could stick it in your pocket and, and just forget about it. It's one of those kind of knives. And what I was been comparing it to is the American Lawman. So it feels in that same kind of feeling as the American Lawman. Now you can tell the American Lawman has definitely got a longer handle and a, a wider handle. But across the back, it's kind of got that same thin thin feeling it kind of has the uh body feel of the air light let me see if i can rustle up an air light here all right so here's the air light <clears throat> so yeah see how it kind of similar in thickness to the air light and very similar in the way it feels air light's got more handle on it this is a lot lighter Move this down just a little bit so you can see a comparison. Let's put the air light in the middle here. So it's almost like an air light recon American lawman kind of conglomeration of DNA there. Let me see if I got a a recon over here. That may be a bridge too far. I don't know if I got a a recon lying around here. <clears throat> I should, but I don't. I'm ashamed. So the OS 10 is a great steel. We've tested it and checked it out and it's just held up to some beatings. Oh, this American Lama, so good. One of my first, first journeys in the cold steel was American Lama. Got it out of a Craigslist ad. The trunk of some dude's car. Yeah, looked like a drug deal going down. But no, it wasn't, it was just cold steel deal. So this feels really good. This feels better than I thought it would. I don't know what I was expecting. I think I was expecting just that GFN feeling, that glass filled nylon feeling again, with just a better steel, and it's totally different. It's a completely different feeling knife. This is more like a, see the, no, that's the wrong knife. That's the wrong cold steel. I grabbed into the bag, grabbed the wrong one. The, GF, the, the GFN version feels more like a Prolite, like a really thin Prolite. But it's still got that same feeling. Just, it's just a different feel. You're not going to break it or destroy it or anything. It's just a different feel. But you can definitely feel that old, that old school kind of cold steel feel with that that uh, G10 G10 scales there. So that feels really good. So check those out if you like this one. If you like the GFN verdict, you're going to love this verdict. Just Almost like the perfect EDC. I don't know what more you'd want from the super tough lock, super tough steel, decent price. Especially when they start hitting the retailers, I imagine they're gonna go go down a little bit in price. But even for what the Cold Steel website wants, this is a decent knife for what you're getting and for that kind of price. Let me know what you think in the comments. Have you got have you had a chance to look at these? What do you think of the air light? What do you think of the American Lawman? If they had a baby, what would you think about that? Okay, I think that's it. Oh, and they have a new updated clip here. So they kind of got they got that new 
cold steel deep pocket clip. So let me know what you think about that. That's pretty cool. A lot of the complaints about old school cold steel stuff is that pocket clip was a real ripper. This new one is a lot better. A lot better for getting it in, getting it out. And I think if they start putting those on some of the older knives, they would feel a lot better too. Let me see what this one is. Yeah, this one's got the new clip. All right, there we go. I think that's it. Just a quick video to introduce you fully to the verdict. If you haven't watched the live stream, I'm going to show them to you over there. But All right, Cold Steel Verdict, the Austin and GT.